In this video, I will show you how to create an awesome logo animation, using Adobe After Effects. Let's get started. Download, and open the Illustrator file. Here I have separated each part of the logo, making it easier to create the animation. Select all the layers, and export them into After Effects. Here I'm using a plugin called Overload to export. If you do not have this plugin, simply drag and drop the Illustrator file into After Effects. These are my composition settings. You can adjust it into the same settings, if you have a different one. Lock the background layer. I will change the color of the ball layer to a different one. So it will easier to identify that layer. Enable the solo layer option. Press the apostrophe key, and enable the margins. Press P, and open position settings. Create three keyframes. Move the timeline to first keyframe position. And move the ball downward. It will automatically replace the keyframe. Next one in an upper position. OK. Select all keyframes, and easy ease them. Go to Graph Editor, and change the speed graph to a shape like this. Let's check the animation. The animation seems good. Go to Effects and Presets. Search for the effect echo. Drag and drop it into this layer. Change the value of echo time, to 0.005. Number of echoes to 7. OK, let's add a motion blur. So click both these two icons. Now the animation seems good. Open opacity settings. Create two keyframes. Zero and 100. Play with the keyframes, and adjust the timing. Now search for the effect fill. Drag and drop it into this layer. Also, I will move all the keyframes to the beginning of the timeline. Remove the solo option. Move the timeline to a position like this. Cut this layer by pressing Ctrl, Shift plus D. Again go to second keyframe and cut the layer. Repeat this step another two times. Select this layer. Pick the color picker tool and change its color to red. Again select the second layer, and change its color to yellow. Repeat this process to all four layers. We do not need this color preset anymore, so I will delete it. Let's check the animation. The animation seems good. Let's animate the icon. Separate these three layers. Again select these two layers. Press S, and open scale settings. Create two keyframes. 0, and 100. Easy ease both keyframes. Go to graph editor, and change the speed graph to a shape like this. Move these two keyframes three frames forward, so we can get a nice flow. Again select this bottom layer, open scale settings, and create two keyframes, 0, and 100. Press R, and open rotation settings, create two keyframes, 0, and 3. Select all keyframes, and easy ease them. Go to Graph Editor, and change the speed graph to a shape like this. The animation seems good. I will move these keyframes, a few frames forward. So we can get a nice flow. Again move all the keyframes to the right place. Play with the keyframes, and adjust the timing of the animation. Move the timeline to this position. 
press alt plus left bracket keys, and cut all those three layers. Check the final animation, and now we are done.